loosen the screws on both sides. Remove the casing. Locate the input, output terminal. Loosen the screw for each terminal. Connecting the AC output wires on the lower left. Next, connect the AC input wires on the upper left. Remove the nut, plain washer, and spring washer from the battery input terminal. Then, connect the positive and negative battery input wires. Finally, connect the solar panel terminal positive and negative. Now we have completed the connection of all cables. Turn on the input circuit breaker and battery circuit breaker. The screen will light up. The main power light will flash. Now measure the input voltage and battery voltage. There is a small switch at the bottom of the machine. Set it to the on position. The main power light will stop flashing. Then use a multimeter to measure, when the output voltage is 220 volt indicates the machine is functioning normally. Once everything is running smoothly, perform a switching test. First, disconnect the main power input circuit breaker. At this point, the system switches to battery power mode. The inverter indicator light up, indicating that the system is now running on battery power. You can press the up button to access a range of parameters. Then, turn the main power input circuit breaker back on. The machine will switch from battery inverter power to mains inverter power. Once you've completed this step, the startup commissioning is finished. Finally, reattach the casing to complete the installation.